S1, January 2014, question 7. We're rolling a dice, which means we can get a 1, a 2, a 3, a 4, a 5 and a 6. I'm going to start with the fourth sentence. The probabilities of getting a 2, a 4 and a 6 are equal. So I'm going to call each of those X. Probability of getting a 3 is equal to the probability of getting a 1. Probability of getting a 6 is twice the probability of a 1. So 1 is half of 6 and 3 is the same as 1. And the probability of a 5 is twice 6. If I add all of those together, I have x over 2 plus x plus x over 2. That's 2x, 3x, 5x, 6x has to equal 1. So x would be 1 sixth which means the probability of getting a 1 is 1 twelfth. I've now written out the table and replaced x by 1 sixth and if the probability of getting a head is 2 thirds then the probability of getting a tail is 1 third. So in part 2 I'm asked to find the probability of getting a head and a 6. So that would be a head followed by a 6 which is 2 thirds multiplied by 1 sixth, 1 ninth. A tail and a prime number would have been a tail and 2, a tail and 3, a tail and 5. So 1 third times 1 sixth plus 1 third times 1 twelfth plus 1 third times 1 third, which is 7 over 36. Final part, part 3, is a binomial. We're going to have four trials and the probability of getting a head and a 6 is 1 ninth. And we want to work out for this binomial distribution probability that it happens once. So that will be 4c1, 1 ninth to the power 1 multiplied by 8 ninths to the power 3, which is 